goodbye to AAP. Alka Lamba as she announces resignation from party Alka Lamba on Friday took to Twitter to announce her resignation from the arm AADMI party. AAP. The time has come to say goodbye to hashtag AAP and to resign from the primary membership of the party. The past six years' journey was a great learning for me, she tweeted. This comes amid reports that she's planning to join Congress. Ex Karnataka CM Siddharamaya slaps. Kush's aid at Mysuru Airport. A video has surfaced online showing Congress leader and former Karnataka CM Siddharamaya slapping and pushing his aid at Mysuru Airport. Speaking about the incident, Sid Aramaya's office stated that the leader got irritated and slapped the aide after he had tried to push the phone to Sid Aramaya asking him to recommend him to some official shift tailing CPI. M. Leader Taragami from Srinagar to Delhi. SCTHE Supreme Court today ordered authorities to shift tailing CPI. M. Leader Muhammad Yusuf Taragami from Srinagar to AIIMS Delhi. Taragami has been under house arrest since August 5, when Article 370 was revoked. The ruling came on a writ of habeas corpus petition filed by CPI. M. S. Sitaram Yetri, who was recently allowed to travel to Srinagar to visit Taragami. Schools should have held debates on J and K move. Yogi on teachers die Uttar Pradesh CM Yogi Adityanath on Thursday said schools should have conducted debates on the abrogation of Article 370 and congratulated PM Narendra Modi and Union Home Minister Amit Shah for the decision. Addressing teachers during a felicitation function on Teachers Day, Yogi asked, is it not the responsibility of teachers to make children aware about good schemes of the government? Quote, Article 370 was never intended to be forever. Shashi Thara Article 370 was never intended to be forever, but the manner in which it was revoked was undoubtedly violative of the spirit of the Constitution. Congress MP Shashi Thara has stated, claiming Congress doesn't defend Article 370, for all time. Thayor added, but to treat it this way and dispense with it so brutally makes us no different from Pakistan.